Last year, I secretly ghost wrote and published my best friend's autobiography. I did not know what I was getting myself into when I became your friend. <laughs> Overnight, Josh became a global best-selling author, but he stubbornly refused to read his own masterpiece, even for a much-requested audiobook version. It was frustrating. Who the heck was he to stand in the way of his own success like that? I just had to do something. So I did. I've got something to show you. Again? What's happened now? Just watch. Here it goes. Chapter 23. A prophecy in Carrotland. <laughs> to our relief, the new channel was doing well, and that gave us warm, fuzzy feelings. Warm, fuzzy feelings are the only way to get through the winter in England. As I always say, warm up and chill out. So about a year into starting Jolly, Ollie, Lizzie, Gabby and I, with Muncho and the Dinosaurus Rex in tow, headed out to New Zealand for a much needed holiday. It was a place I've always wanted to go since Josh. reading Harry Potter, and I was really excited. Today, oh my gosh! You are about to become the first person in history to unknowingly read, record and release your own audio book. I'm really scared! <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> what is that? I worked with a team of audio engineers to create a synthesized version of your voice. I hired out a recording studio in East London. I delivered an incredible performance as you, and then my voice through AI was converted into your voice. You are about to become the first person in history to release a deep faked audiobook. <laughs> hang on, hang on. <laughs> it's just different than the last AI voice that oh, you made. Yeah, I mean, that's text to speech, baby. That's like not even in the same universe as this. Chapter 22, Jolly. <laughs> At this point in my life, things seem to be going swimmingly well. I was hitched to an incredible woman. Korean Englishman was going down as well as a cobble street in a top hat. <laughs> <The fridge. laughs> that, that just then was incredibly disconcerting. Yeah. It, I mean, it's amazing, It right? sounded very accurately like me. <laughs> yeah, it is. It is. Literally, it's so good, you can listen to a whole audiobook and you wouldn't know it's digitally created. Now, uh, obviously, I didn't do this alone. I did it with okay. an amazing team of engineers from a company called Respeecher. Uh, we actually have them <laughs> on the here, line. Right? They are they're, watching. They're here. Yeah. Vitali, Hi. how are you doing? Hi, Josh. My Vitaly. sincere congratulations <laughs> on the release of your audiobook. <laughs> Great work. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Now, Vitaly and the team are literally world leading in the field of voice synthesis. That makes more sense. <laughs> yeah. What is also interesting is they are based in Ukraine. Vitaly, you're joining us from Kyiv, is that right? Yes, yes, that's right. I'm in Kyiv uh, in our headquarter office. I was amazed, to be honest, when the war first broke out, we sent you guys an email and we're just like, are you okay? Also, don't worry about this really stupid project. <laughs> and, uh, and you were like, no, we're continuing to work. Yeah, you know, uh, it's quite simple and hard at the same time. If you are not involved in direct fighting with, with Russians, then you need to work double uh, hard as, as you were before because you need to restore your economy or house, like in my case, uh, and donate to armed forces, volunteers, etc. It's clear what we need to do, but it's hard to, at the same time. What Ukrainians have shown this uh, resilience in working hard and, and fighting back at the same time. Wow. I know that this isn't the only thing you guys have been working on. They did Darth Vader's voice for the recent Kenobi wow. series, uh, among, <laughs> among many other that. things. That was really good. I know. It was really, it's really, really amazing. So what's it been like working on such a um, meaningless project? <laughs> <laughs> okay. um, it was actually our first uh, audio book. And the challenge was that we had to convert everything, every word, so no um, imperfections will be there and the listener of the book won't be distracted. We trained a neural network that knows your voice and can convert 
all these voice to your voice. Okay. So it, you've trained a neural, it's literally AI. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh. We decided to donate all of the money raised from the sale of the audiobook to UNICEF's Ukraine campaign, which goes towards looking after children displaced by the conflict. Thank you so much, Vitaly, for the work that you've done on this. It's been an absolute pleasure to work with you. <laughs> stay safe, stay strong. Yeah, thank you for being part of this. Really appreciate it. It, it was pretty fun. <laughs> That's good. That's really good. See you later. Bye. Bye. Wow. 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 Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I should say, actually, uh, yeah. Jolly members have yeah. access to the book already. For free? In the form of a YouTube video. Okay. I got a bit carried away and <laughs> fed every page of the book into a neural network that produced artwork based on <laughs> the audiobook. So if you want to check that out... <laughs> oh, <become> business <laughs> manager didn't know that. He just face palmed so hard. Oh, man. I'm so relieved. Why? <laughs> you just you no don't idea. know what it's like it's been a lot to of do work. something. It's been a lot of work for nine months. Yeah, no, I don't. And then it all the reveal come all down to like one moment. Yeah. It was actually pretty useful that I had the AI version of you that I built last week, because for the last week, I've actually been rehearsing this reveal to the AI no, version of you no. over and over again. <laughs> so I could get it just right. <laughs> That's what that was for, I see. So get out there and order the incredible audiobook which I definitely read all of, Once Upon a Time in Carolan. And look, I know what you're thinking. How on earth did Ollie convince me to record this plug for an audiobook he produced without my knowledge? Well, in actual fact, this isn't Josh speaking. It's Ollie synthesizing Josh's voice onto mine. This AI model has come in pretty handy. I've even used it to re-record some of Josh's voiceovers in our recent Korean English one series. And with over 25 million views so far, no one's noticed. You're joking. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's switch off the model for a bit and just be completely real. Guys, please do consider buying the audiobook. You'll be supporting a really good cause and we and the team put in a lot of work on this project. And besides, I did deliver a very good performance. I know what you're thinking. Isn't that a bit arrogant of Ollie to say about his own audiobook performance? Which is why this isn't actually Ollie speaking. He's miming. We created a second AI model of Ollie's voice, which we've mapped onto Andy's performance, so Ollie could be completely sincere in this monologue. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you jolly soon. All right, let's do the advert. Okay. Do you want to read it, or shall I? Why don't you read it, and then we can make it me. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> Just a quick word to thank Opera for sponsoring this episode. You may have noticed that I used Opera to showcase the audiobook. We like it because it's super fast and the team at Opera have added some really useful features like WhatsApp integration and you can control Spotify and Apple Music through the browser. I think the best feature is actually the pinboard, which I've found super useful not just for Josh's shining new websites, but also for saving interesting things I find while browsing and, and planning, planning to, to buy for future episodes. <laughs> <laughs> if you visit the link in the description, you can try out all of the AI Josh websites for yourself. And that website is actually a pin board which we put together using the Opera browser. You can actually even react to all of the pages on the pin board with emojis. It's really cool. Oh my so, gosh. if you want to see more of this crazy kind of content from me and Ollie, oh please support the channel by going to the link in the description of this video, downloading the Opera browser, and trying its awesome features for yourself. Seriously, thank you to Opera for sponsoring this episode. Please support our channel by downloading Opera.